I'm going to use um, the grid method to do the examples from today's lesson, finding quotients and remainders. Okay, so we want to divide this quadratic by x minus 2. So I'm going to set up my grid to divide by x minus 2. And I know that I'm aiming for all the pieces in the box to add up to x squared plus 7x plus 3. So the first term is x squared. So in order to make x squared, I know I'm going to do x times x. And now I can multiply these two terms together to get minus 2x. But I don't want minus 2x, I want add 7x. So I need 2 plus 9x to make that happen. And now we think, what do we multiply x by to make plus 9x? And we need a plus 9. So I can now multiply these two together to fill this bit in. Negative 2 times positive 9 is negative 18. Now, we have run out of powers of x, and that means we've come to the end of the quotient, but we have got take away 18, and we need add 3. So we need to plus 21. There's nothing that I can multiply x by to make plus 21, except um, a fraction. So that means that this is our remainder. So the quotient is the answer when we've done the division, which is x plus 9. And the remainder is the leftover bit, so that is 21. And if we wanted to, we could write our calculation as x squared plus 7x plus 3 over x minus 2 will give us an x plus 9 and then we've got a 21 out of x minus 2 left. The second example follows. Okay, so here we are. We're going to um, write this algebraic fraction in this form. We simply need to carry out the division. So again, we do our grid. We're dividing by 2x minus 3, so I'm going to have a line for each of those terms. I need to start with my first term here, so 2x squared. And I think, what do I multiply 2x by to make 2x squared? Just x. Okay, but what do I get if I multiply x and negative 3? I get negative 3x. I don't want to have negative 3x. I want to have plus 5x, so I need to add an extra 8x. And then we think, what do we multiply 2x by to make plus 8x? We multiply it by positive 4. But if I multiply these two terms together, I get minus 12. I don't want that. I want a plus 1. So that means I need to add 13. And now I can't multiply 2x by anything to make 13 unless I use a fraction. So that means that we get... 2x squared plus 5x plus 1 divided by 2x minus 3 will give us x plus 4. Plus, we have a spare 13 out of 2x minus 3 left over.